Hey guys, it's me, Monks with the Tears of the Storm, King Planet Countdown. Today we're playing Reyna. Reyna is a ranged assassin who has a lot of survivability through his one passive ability. He has two passives. So yeah, let's get into the game. Anytime you're ready. Why is there a level 9 Valor in a level 40 game? Uh, and we don't have any in the levels. So that's a bit weird. Let's rock their world. So this Valor is level nine. And she's got very high level ranked teammates, but still she's level nine. Battle begins in ten seconds. This is a two move Spider Queen map, and we have Abatha, Kale, Sonia, four, Diablo, and Reyna three, versus Asmodan, Abatha, Vala, Artanis, and the Butcher. <laughs> One. Oh, I almost drank from the healing well. So, personally, I like give me more. But the season marks him as good too. So, let's try this. A Dexter means level 10 with his character. And this is what he does. This is going to be very, very similar, but not not exactly the same. We're changing one talent. So, Ring's passive is called Advanced Optics. His basic attack range is a lot further than other heroes, and he sees a lot further. This is like Nova's passive like stuff. A Q score pantry and rounds is a skill shot based ability that will um, fire a attack that will not back and deal damage to enemies. Now W is called Inspire, this will buff our, our attack speed and nearby allies' attack speed. And our E is called Adrenaline Rush. This will. Uh, basically, this will give us health when we drop low. When we're below 30% health, it'll give us a lot. All day long. So the foot is near us, so we're just gonna knock him away. We have three stacks of our season marksman talent. We have four just now, so this means I have four bonus attack damage, which is actually pretty good. At level four, we will be taking focused attack. This Pumped is a very good go. talent. <laughs> um, so it's basically, it was a crit every twelve seconds, I believe. Is just a, yeah, a crit against heroes every like twelve seconds. Or All day long. So yeah, the butcher is missing, and we're gonna hand it. Sounds so I don't want to get charged by butcher because butcher's nasty, and I don't want to be anywhere near him. So we've already got six stacks of our trait, uh, of our season maximum, which is very good for three minutes into the game. Gives a lot of extra damage at this point. And here's our first web we just... Build is not like any of the cookie cutter builds which are used. This is a very different build. It's about trying to kill someone very fast. 
River's clever. And I will need to back soon. Because the butcher's really handsome. Must keep the scene again. Um, the self range should be taking hamstring shot. Oh, why did that activate? I wish it didn't, because that means we just wasted it. Uh, hamstring shot makes our Q slow for 33 seconds. This is very good. Uh, it's also very good when comboed with some of the other talents, Sounds like, like level 16 player. talent uh, Executioner. I'm personally not a fan of Executioner ever. The is. But I hate the talent, so I'm my probably not going to use it. Time to face my so yeah, plus we don't have that many rival CCs aside from me. So we can do a lot of damage. Deliver the gems to my altar before your enemies. You can count so the butcher is quite a lot farm based daily compared to some of the other heroes. Like the butcher, he does need to be in the lane for a while to pick up his season marks and stacks. If you go for the talent, I wouldn't normally go for it. I would normally go for um, give me more. All day long. But season marksman is very good still. So yeah, we have 11 stacks already, which is really good. We can buff our attack speed to let us kill us a bit quicker. This should be good. This is our attack range. That is uh, as Asmanam. Just gonna mark him away. So we interrupt that. So at level 10, we will be picking up Reina's Raiders. This is our first hero, uh, second hero choice. The other is the Hyperion, which isn't very powerful. It does, it's good at sieging, but nothing else. I can probably kill this Asthma now. So let's just, um, this. This equals have some Banshees that will help us kill, and this should be a kill. Yeah. You gotta be faster than that. When the arena hits level 10, it's not really a good idea to engage I on don't. him because he's gonna be able to uh, kill you pretty quick with Reina's Raiders. So yeah, it calls them two banshees if I didn't say that. I'm not sure if I did. Banshees are cloaked initially when they come down and then they'll exit cloak when they're attacking. So we're just gonna go back to some health and then we're gonna go back bot. Level 13, we're taking Giant Killer. This is much easier to kill heroes with it. Uh, it's also the best choice. I don't think the other choices are very good. Well, at this. Leader is kind of like the oh. tank talent. Relentless. Is it only on me actually? I don't know who's right there. No, it's um. Okay. I don't think it's a very good talent, but let's see. I don't. Uh, for an assassin. Neil's an absent mind, by the way. I mean, oh, I didn't know that didn't kill it. Okay. I'm not, a, I'm not a Reina player. There is a lot of good Reina players. I am not one. I just kind of know how to build him. So we do have our trait, and we have 17 stacks on our season marksman, so we're going to be doing a huge amount of damage, because we've been able to farm a lot. So 
So we just got some more web weavers. And we're soon gonna get 18 stacks. There it is. And now we're gonna hard push the same with Abba. We'll be in a minion way to meet him. We're gonna buff our creeps in. I believe this also buffs Abba's real minions. I wish he's telling me to stop playing the app, but he's doing really well. He would kill this meal immediately. There was no point in playing it then, honestly. Oh, why didn't we take the giant kill? I thought we clicked on it. Oops. Okay, we're gonna go mid now. Because we farmed up enough of our season marks now, so we have 20 sacks of it. And we've killed the so we don't need to do it anymore. I would say something about the song here. Uh, but I'm not. So you're a to inflict a lot of damage. I'm gonna instantly hand in a lot of gems. 33 gems already in, so. We also need to really quickly kill the butcher. Because he has 40 gems, and them losing 40 gems is huge. So, Reign of vs. Valor is a very fit fight. It's not a very fit fight. Reign of will win the fight, usually. We should, if we should. I shouldn't have looked away. That was a good kill by the out lover. Oh, I thought we had another chance. Dick. You can count on me. I could take that camp. The butcher's our top priority. We need to kill him very quick. And the butcher needs to die very quick because he has his count on me. Uh, trait. No, not his trait. It's the thing which gives him like. The sickle. The sickle, I think it's called. The butcher's brown, is it? So we're gonna use our inspire to give everything some more attack speed. At level 16, we're taking berserk. Now, to me, a lot of people who don't agree with this choice. And that is fine. Everyone has their own opinions. Um, I just personally think it's the best choice. Now Asmodan has 54 gems. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. Your They're gonna... Our entire team is dead. You will know my Except power. Abatha, who's really risky to put Christian. Don't die, Abby. And, um... The Everyone else is dead. Right so this is not you. good. Just happened. I actually do like this ad for though, because he's playing really risky and I don't get He should needs to he needs to run it's away. Run in that situation is a very good chance. Um, there's no way you can escape that ult, so I find it better just to run towards him after I'm very little health. So we almost killed him with that. Um, we are going to go in. W1 start killing him very fast. Uh, what killed me? It wasn't Azmodan. And the butcher didn't hit me. Neither did Artanis. 
Okay, I just died for no reason. What's this a level 10 kale? It looks different, which is how you can tell. It looks kind of like, it looks really cool. Level 10 kale. Pyro's gonna hit one person. I don't like Pyro. I don't think Pyro's a very good ability at all. I played against him with the Kale and he took Pyro in both the games. And never get used to that. He didn't go well. And he was like a level 14 Kale or something. I mean, that's not good. So the Banshees are very good. They lost 22 seconds, which is kind of weird time to stop. It's a very good one. He's gonna try and kill someone. It's the best choice. When you get chasing me, you want to try and kill someone. Unless you think you can get out. But, but you obviously wouldn't have got out there. There was no way. And we need to kind of stop from handing in because they, they don't have enough. They'll be like, I think, one off from handing in. But still, we need to try and stop them. And there's a weird clone. I don't know why he did that then, but okay. Ow! He must have found the battle a lot. He took the pants. Yeah, he did. That must be a very high tax because that's a lot of damage. So we do have the Cirque available. This allows us to kill someone very quick, as we saw earlier. And let's have a look at some damage numbers. So. We're doing both. I mean, we have a lot of high-end characters though, so it's not a big surprise. Let's activate the now. And we didn't need the Zerk, actually. Oh well. Bearing in mind, for the first lot of the team fight, for the first good about 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes of the game, we didn't know. For the first about 10 minutes of the game, we weren't doing anything but farming. So we won't have as high damage as some of the people who were there from the game. At level 20, there are two choices. And the one I like is Duskwings. Yeah. So we're going to take them. I used to do this build a lot in Hero League before they reset my rank. It was back before Reina. That was back when I actually took the other talents all the time. So yeah. Your Q is a very powerful skill. It's like a Nova, which Nova Q. I think it does a bit less damage. It also knockbacks and it goes through stuff. I think it's a bit weaker than Nova still though, because it knocks back. Uh, so you, it can help enemies escape, whereas Novas will just kill them. It doesn't do enough damage to my taste. So, we do have our level 20 talent. So, our Banshees are always cloaked. Oh, sorry, I, I suppose they can be revealed for their abilities, but still. Keep destroyed. I still think Banshee's a stronger ult than the Hyperion. The Hyperion was based on the Battle Cruiser ult, where it summons the Yamoto Cannon upon towers, forts, etc. I don't no think it's very powerful. Sounds like a plan. It also does some decent AoE damage. They did buff it, because before you couldn't take the Hyperion unless you were trolling. It's the only reason you would take the Hyperion before they buffed it. So we are going to go to help, and that is one dead butcher. <laughs> once. Okay. Uh, okay, good, we got it. Let's go. And we just saw an, um, an Abathur who escaped. And it's gonna be. Ow! That does so much damage! We don't have a Drake, which is going to be very hard for him. 
Let's hope one of our team. Nah, that's not gonna happen. Come on. If one of them got the regen, we'll move it really bad. We can get this regen over. Well, it's good. Ah, uh, we could probably take out the core at this point, actually. Uh, by the way, the only talent when I used to play ring there back in here, which I didn't take is season mark, so I took the other talent anymore. And I ne I don't think I ever lost the game with this build. Because it is very powerful. Oh, stalkers. Very good at easily killing someone. And that is such a risky yeah, but I like it. I think that's not good. Maybe we'll back door out Oh, I'm not going to pull back now. Let's see if we can use our ult on this Asmodan. Pull out some Banshees to aid us. We also attack more three points, so we're doing more damage to them. Uh, we should have just W one when we killed him. And because we had the one twenty talent, which makes our banshees attack more frequent, we just gotta kill him. I just died, that's unfortunate. Not much to talk about. Let's um, make it count. We do have 41 long. stacks on season marks, which is a huge amount. As long as we get at least 40 stacks, this is a worthy talent because this is just so so good. Uh, oops. <laughs> oh, this he's dead. Good. No way. He's fine now. Yes. Kill Half health and still kills him. <laughs> It does so much damage, but the half the time is just not worth it. I would always take the Phoenix. Your enemies desire my power, and it shall aid them. So I'm not afraid of a butcher that's not a real butcher. And I believe that was the arcane barrier talent. That's it. Turns his mana into. I think it's like 200% of your mana into her, into a shield or something. Very good talent. Just, I wouldn't. I. There's some other talents which I prefer. I think I prefer over it. That's a lot of characters for me, though. Like, this time can be good, but I prefer this. We're also going to destroy this wall, so if Adam wants to do a factor again like that, he can. And he won't see the nest. The enemy outpost soon comes to mine it. Let's attack their core. It is over. Sounds like plan. He is in base now, the enemy outpost. He'll probably don't No, we can't. No. Sounds like a plan. This is really risky to me. Father is just going to take that that looks. Or the clone of Father. Yeah, the clone of Father. Ow. I'm calling in a retreat. Raiders roll. Yeah. Mm. No, we should actually attack the core. Let's attack their core. I think that's the best choice. Rainer's a very good base for that character, so it makes use of it, I suppose. So. Um, oh! That's unfortunate. So he, he 
broke line of sight just before the phoenix finished so he would have died but he didn't and now he's using the okay <laughs> don't use it on the tank please don't use it on the tank wow that is a lot <laughs> this should be good so we're gonna head back calling in a retreat So, we need to win this soon because this is very ridiculous now. Oh, nice. Have me out for dead. For a long time. I'm gonna go up and deal with this. I'm pretty sure they're there. It's all good. Well done. Headshot. He did do some damage though. Pretty good damage to me. Our damage is third, uh, fourth in the game. As my man's doing a lot, which isn't a surprise Sounds considering like he's been doing like a third of my health with those um, Qs, but still, a lot of damage for a specialist. Sounds <laughs> like I'm sorry, but you shouldn't be in the middle of a creep wave of Abathur, if even if you're gonna do that. Let's attack their core. Can't yeah, go in. Seven hour. Can't cheese one. W one. And you can kill it very quick. Our batches died. <laughs> um, just gonna disengage until the blinds off us and then rebuff our attack speed and the core is dead. Okay, GG. I do feel that that was a fairly close game at the end. So. Uh, stats. Takedowns. Abafo had two takedowns. That tells me that he wasn't doing very much to help with the kills. Deaths, we had a very average, very, very average. Um, siege damage, we didn't have very high siege damage. We did have higher than the Butcher, who was who we were up against in the lane, which is fine, I suppose. We had four highest damage in the game, which is fairly good, I'd say. We don't have a roll, but Sonya tanked very well. And we were fourth on XP contribution, second on that team, which is very good. So, talents. Uh, season marksman is what I would go for. There is one alternative, which is give me more. Uh, I personally prefer give me more. I think that's what it's called. I can just go for it right here, can't I? I prefer give me more because it's just more healing. Um, level four, you go for focused attack. The other choice is Vampiric Assault. I don't think this is very good. Uh, Vampiric Assault is very good for sustain. At level 7, you go Hamstring Shot. I don't think there's any other choice here, honestly. No other choice, because all, uh, all of the others are bad. Level 10, you go for Rings Raiders. Hyperior isn't very good. Unless you use not to push, which you know, that's fascist. 13, you go for Giant Killer. Very good at killing tanks. At level 16, you go for Berserk. I like this Um, I think Berserk is the best choice here. The other choice is, of course, Executioner. At level 20, you go for uh, three choices here Duskwings, Nexus, Yurit Frenzy, and Bolt of the Storm. Uh, I would normally look at Dusk Wings and Bolt of the Storm, but Nexus Rounds, you can still be good. So, hope you enjoyed this video, and goodbye.